too much hair. Too much hair. Are we good? We on? All right, man. Here we go. This is Tempest in Indiana. GR Imperial Amp. Hosting commentary while we look over doubles. Looks like they're getting a quick little button check in before we get started. We got, uh, oh, shoot. We got uh, Jang Home and Rusky versus uh, GR Damn It and GR Forsaken. Excuse me. RC Jang Home. I'm not sure if Rusk is part of a team. I'm pretty sure he's not. Solo, solo dolo player out here. Plays Diddy. So we got Jiggly Falcon versus uh, Diddy Luigi. The uh, side of the road uh, accordion player in his eight trying to get some coins. And off the bat, man. Off the bat, red team catching hands. Ferociously so. Ferociously so. They need a little bit of help right now. They need to work together, try and get some sort of a stage presence back. Getting bullied off stage. Captain Falcon, nice uppercut to give Jigglypuff a way back on. Jigglypuff returning the favor by fairing him off the stage. And now all that leads to Jiggly losing first stock already. They need to conserve stocks a little bit better. Diddy and Luigi are not the type of characters you want to fall behind on, that's for sure. Oh my goodness, Captain Falcon losing the stock just like that. It's very dangerous for Captain Falcon. He can get gimped super easy off stage against uh, characters like Diddy that have uh, arcing projectiles. Diddy using monkey flip to get back to the stage. They really need to hold on to the stage control, but they lost it. Neutral's been reset. Accidental, uh, the perfect shield ends up dang near reflecting the uh, uppercut back in a Jiggly. Jiggly looking for a way in. Using rollout to try and... Uh, Try and get a little bit of space. Espacio for Captain Falcon. The rollout works though. And Captain Falcon gets the, the, the kill confirmed and decides to take Jigglypuff on a ride too with the up smash. Now they're down a stock, but it's a lot more manageable. They're not too far behind. One good play off stage, and Jiggly does have that uh, the aerial mo mobility. And look at that. Just like that, Jigglypuff gimping the mess out of that Luigi. So now it's dead even. Right now, Captain Falcon hanging out combo mills. Those jabs giving him a little bit of space on the left side of the stage. Oh. Oh! And the Jigglypuff rest combo, they were practicing that at the house. Oof. She's got to be careful, though. She's got to make sure that each one kills, though. She does that haphazardly. She's going to get sent to the Shadow Realm. Oh, my goodness. And he flops right into an up smash. Head game strong. Scoop. She decides to just go for the ledge. Be safe. Oh. That's not going to do it because he can still mash. Yeah. Luigi's got a lot of options to get back to the stage vertically and uh, and horizontally, but uh, very straightforward in his ways of getting back. So Luigi looking for, for a move, up smash on the Jiggly, but the Jiggly manages to escape. Oh, my goodness. And smacks him with those little Powerpuff Girl nubs. Diddy and Luigi. Lost their open lead, and now the percents are almost matching, except Captain Falcon has quite a bit of damage on him. Oh, and the dash attack kills the Diddy. Now Luigi's all by himself. He's going to die at 30% if he gets a good grab. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. And Forsaken nubbing him out. Oh, he manages to get back. Oh. Reads the smash attack and spot dodges. Good job by Jank Home. Oh, my goodness. One, two. Made her look like a puncher back for sitting there. Joan Home is going to need to pull some Luigi magic out of his hat right now. Oh, my goodness. Scoop the tomahawk. <gasps> oh, and he just goes for it and jabs through a shield to stop the rollout. She's spinning. Trying to bait out some sort of bad move. He decides to stay in shield and just take the hit on the backswing to allow him to work some out. And the down smash breaks it down and gets the kill. Oh, no. Luigi Magic? He's got to be careful off that stage. Oh, my goodness. And he brings it back, uses his nose to pop the mess out of that Jigglypuff on the way back up. Luigi's up smash. Nothing to play with, man. Nothing to play with. Way too long with lots of knockback on it. Real easy to get sent flying. So, uh, 
Forsaken and Damon are known to, to work together, but sometimes they end up hitting each other. A lot of the times when we're, you know, at the GR house during practice days, they, they uh, start having arguments and such. So, you know, that's – I think their synergy needs to increase – this next oncoming game if they want him to, to beat Rusky and Jankholm because Jankholm is like a I, I, I guess he's like a master key man he just fits in all sorts of teams he always ends up being the clutch man in the end uh, he loves this character dearly he knows the ins and outs of Luigi probably a large majority of his matchups if not all his matchups so where are we going we're going to FD uh, which is nice nice neutral stage for everyone I would say uh that I would have definitely wanted to go maybe Smashville uh, red team. Oh, never mind. Not yet. <laughs> oh, right now red team is uh, uh, split up and divided. Uh, Captain Falcon does real good with Rage, though. Will kill you with that Raptor boost at profound percents man i've seen him kill it like 80 percent on someone a bit lighter oh and he gets the triple cheese uppercut taking out captain falcon please 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 use the banana to try and help out jigglypuff a little bit to land jigglypuff does struggle to land at times either has to burn all of her jumps oh my goodness oh my goodness oh the jab saves him that broken shield, a lot of things could have happened there. They weren't able to get their inputs out. Luigi jab too strong. Or too clutch, I'd say. Oh, and he tries to wrap the boost and get scooped out of the animation. Oh. Oh, and he reads the... Oh, wow. Misfires and rest galore missing. Jigglypuff using that dare to try and... Uh, what in the world was that? Diddy Kong just slip and slid out of the, the up B animation. That was kind of crazy. Oh, my goodness. And animations are kind of clashing right now. A lot of things are being canceled out. There's a lot of jank going on in this game. I'll say that. And Diddy Kong might lose their first stock. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, my goodness. He tries to hit him with the secret technique. Runaway side B. Didn't work, though. Rusty was ready for that. Oh, the banana is there to stop rolls. Maybe uh, soft get-ups. And Captain Falcon thirsty for a kill. Tried to get the Raptor boost. Finally gets the back air to connect. Now they definitely need that Luigi to lose a stock. They need the Luigi to lose a stock, and they, they, oop. Oh, my goodness. They're trying to keep those two split up, which is a smart move because, uh, oh, my goodness. And he accidentally, Banana Slam is his own partner. Say, hey, homie, I dropped my keys down there. Can you go get that for me? Oh. That's really scary. Both characters were just, uh. Fox trotting side to side. Both characters having moves that they could easily abuse uh, with quick framework. So landing over there was just, just like stepping in a landmine field. Ooh, up smash. Is it going to kill? It's going to kill. So long, hot shot. <gasps> Misses the banana. Now, the funny thing about Jigglypuff is, is as trash as Jigglypuff is considered to be in the tier list, Jigglypuff can actually do a couple of things here. What he can do is he can camp the ledge and possibly force either some thirst or scoop someone off of their feet and take them on a riot because Jigglypuff's uh, Puff's offstage game is excellent, in my opinion. Uh, double damage in the air. Uh, the moves come out very quick, you, very spammable, able to gimp someone all the way down the map and still have plenty of jumps to get back up. Oh, goodness, he tries to use the sing, like I was saying, trying to jank him out. And jank home. Not falling for it. Oh, goodness. There's the misfire. Oh, he John, John lose the misfire. Uh-oh. Holds him down for the, the bear. That'll do it. Team Rusky and Jank come clutching out the game. Forsaken and Damn are going to have a lot of time in between matches to try and figure out some more team combinations. 